name is uh, Mark. Uh, I come from from Denmark, uh, where I work as an engineer, uh, and I'm I'm here in Tanzania with my with my girlfriend, uh, and I just climbed the Kilimanjaro, uh, and it was something that we casually, my girlfriend and I talked about, like uh, I don't know, maybe half a year ago, like it could be a good thing to to try because my parents tried it, and so we we we. We bought the ticket and everything, and booked the hotel, and started training for this uh, for this uh, for this trip. Uh, and yeah, I, I just got down uh, a few hours ago, actually, uh, and it was a like a seven seven day trip. Uh, the Limushi Limushi route, I believe it's called, uh, and it was like compared to the final day, the the, the days prior to that was was nothing. Uh, I did uh, suffer from like I got some very bad headaches from 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 being so high up, uh, and my girlf girlfriend didn't. So we were we were she was she was very supportive supportive when 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 we sort of arrived at the camp because that was when I had had the worst headaches because whenever I was exposed to heat or whenever I went into the tent or just stood still actually it, it sort of just accelerated uh, and so she would take care of me once we got to the camps and I would take care of her uh, in the mornings and in the in during the night because she was she was cold and she had trouble eating and a bit of trouble getting out of bed and put her stuff together and so that was that was when I took over. So she helped me, and I helped her. Uh, so in that way, we supported each other quite well. Um, I I don't think like I expected uh, it to be to be very tough. I certainly did, but it was tougher. It it was way tougher than than, than what I expected actually. Because on the last day towards the summit. There was a moment where I thought, now it's enough, because I, my headache was just, like it was, it was unreal, and every time I took a took a breath, it was it's it was stinging all over my body, and my backpack felt like it was weighing a hundred kilos, and I just, <laughs> I, I couldn't do it. So I, this, this is saying when I get the, like something I say whenever I get frustrated or you know the situation just gets too unmanageable either you you yell or you hit someone or you cry and I cry <laughs> I cried a little bit uh, luckily it was dark so no one saw me uh, but it was just I, I, I just couldn't cope I, I, I have not experienced something that was so physically demanding for me and I've tried some stuff uh, but this this beats it uh, but despite the the pain and everything uh, I made it all the way to Uhuru Peak with my girlfriend and back down again 